while a typical depth estimation solution relies on multiple cameras and a lot of complex math operations, TikTok's Depth Anything accomplishes it with one camera and a bit of computer vision. In this video, we're going to understand about Depth Anything and run inference with it. Hey there, welcome to Learn Open CV. Monocular depth perception extracts the depth cues from various image features such as texture, object sizes, shading, and perspective. Some of the depth anything applications can be sea animal depth estimation, human action observation, gesture recognition, wildlife monitoring, urban environments, and terrain mapping. But monocular struggles with accurate depth estimation as it relies on indirect cues and assumptions about the scene. Stereo vision, however, creates accurate depth maps as it uses two images from slightly different viewpoints. Thus, monocular vision will face and disadvantage in a featureless or textureless environment, whereas stereo vision fails during occlusions. Depending on the technique, monocular vision may or may not be computationally expensive. But stereo vision will be, as it matches points between two images. Hence, monocular vision is ideal for resource-constrained environments, making it cost-effective. Whereas, stereo vision requires two cameras and additional calibration. Monocular vision is not suitable when accurate depth information is vital. For those cases, it is recommended to employ 3D LiDAR object detection. Click here to know more about it. Now, let's see how to estimate the depth using Depth Anything. To follow along with me, open the Learn Open CV blog post link from the description, click on the download code banner, fill in your details and hit enter. You'll receive the starter code link on your email, download it and let's get started. First, clone the depth anything GitHub repo and change directory into it. Both the scripts accept the encoder model that is small base or large, the image or video path which can be a single image or a video file or a directory containing all the images or videos or a text file with the images or video paths followed by the output results directory. You can also specify PRED only for just the depth map and grayscale if you don't want a colored map. Let's run both these codes and see the results. Our encoder model is the large model. These are the image outputs. And these are the video outputs. If these concepts are difficult to grasp, check out OpenCV University's free TensorFlow and Keras bootcamp. Go to opencv.org slash university slash free courses to know more. To understand the Depth Anything pipeline, check out our blog post on learnopencv.com. The link will be in the description. So, that's all about Depth Anything. If you like this video, check out our playlist on computer vision and deep learning fundamentals. Do comment on what you would like to see next and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Until next time.